Hi everyone, this is Whirlwind from Warcraft Design and this video is a tutorial for the installation of Warcraft Chronicles of the Second War Tides of Darkness. So, first you need to own Warcraft 3 Reforge. If you already own the game, you can go on the Hive Workshop and click on Download here to get the campaign file. If you want to play the French or the Chinese version, you have to scroll down and click on one of those flags. Aside from this video, you have the instructions here in the tab Installation Guide. You also have free mirror links here. So when you have downloaded everything, you will have three files. The campaign file, the installer, and the asset file, which contains all the textures. So the first thing you will do is go on your uh, hard drive, program file, Warcraft 3, and put the CSW installer here. Also, you will put the TOD campaign asset file here too. When it's done, you can double click on the installer, click load resource, and load the TOD campaign asset. Once this is done, you will get this message, and you can go on your documents, Warcraft 3 campaigns, and put the campaign file here. So here, it's the French version. If you don't have this folder, you have to launch the game and click within the game on custom campaign. It will automatically create this folder. Once this is done, you should reboot your computer in order to make sure that everything is installed correctly. Then you can go on your Battle.net launcher and click play on Warcraft 3 Reforged and play the custom campaign. If you launch the campaign and the textures are missing, you have to reinstall the textures. This is a known bug. And this is why this tutorial is being made. A very important point is that if you have any crash issues, this is due to the Warcraft 3 cache. So in order to avoid this issue, you have to delete everything that has been related to former versions of the game, including the demo if you have played it two years ago. So make sure to erase every file related to this game and all your saves. And this will solve the crash issues. Now, on the behalf of the whole team, we thank you very much for playing. We remain available for any questions on our public Discord, and we hope you enjoy the game. Thank you everybody for listening.